Today's habitat tip is going to talk about something that is really important. You can do anywhere in the country and you can do whether we're talking about a backyard project, an acreage, or a large CRP field like this one. And that is to think about including milkweed species in your next habitat project or management activities. You know, as a wildlife biologist, I can trace my interest in wildlife, prairies, prairie plants, milkweeds, back to the third grade. And in the third grade, Mrs. Abby brought into our classroom an aquarium with a monarch butterfly caterpillar on milkweed. And the class learned about the biology of monarch butterflies, the relationship to milkweeds, and the incredible story of the annual monarch butterfly migration. I'm sure we all understand the relationship between the monarch butterfly and the milkweed plant, but have you ever really stopped to think when was the last time that you really saw monarch butterflies? Most people aren't aware that in the last 10 years, the wintering population of monarch butterflies has decreased by over 93%. Those decreases can be attributed to two main reasons, habitat loss and drought in the upper Midwest and Great Plains. The habitat loss can be directly associated with advances in agricultural herbicide programs, primarily the development and use of Roundup Ready crops. Gone are the days when children would be sent into bean fields to remove the unwanted weeds that were common in the field, like milkweed. Today, our crop fields are cleaner and milkweeds are far less common on the landscape. You know, including any species of milkweed in your next habitat project is important for a number of reasons. It's critically important to monarch butterflies and their life history and reproduction. It is a great plant for honeybees and producing honey. It provides the kind of size and structure that we like for great wildlife habitat because it attracts the small, soft-bodied insects that are so critical to the diet of growing pheasant and quail chicks. And if you've never stopped to smell the blossom of a common milkweed in the month of July, I think it's the best smelling wildflower out there. Hey, putting milkweed into your next habitat project or management activity, it's important to do. You can find a milkweed species that will work anywhere in the country, and you can do it all the way from your backyard to a big project like this one. And you might just instill a passion for wildlife in the next third grader. Milkweed, great for honeybees, native pollinators, pheasants, quail, and monarch caterpillars. Putting milkweed into your next project, that's great habitat.